So again, thank you for joining with us today, and we'll just get on with the show. Um, so context is everything, and I just wanted to set this up with a little bit of a story so you can kind of understand where where this all appeared from. So about 2005, um, I started doing improvement work, and um, a lot of it, it was um, easy. Some of it was really easy, and some of it was really hard. Um, and I, I got to a point about a year and a half into it where I realized I'd hit a brick wall with, with my work. And initially, I thought it was all around teamwork and communication. And um, it was it, that part of it was true, uh, but I didn't get the whole picture until many years later. Um, in about um, about this same time, I also realized that I had set, kind of become this uh, chaotic person in my work. And how did that come to be? And I, at one day, um, a few years, uh, about 2006, seven there, I decided that I, I didn't want to be that way anymore. And so I just said no. And I, I stopped my practice of being uh, running around the department like crazy. And that really helped because I could see where I was becoming a product of my environment. And I'm going to talk about that just in a, in a slide or two. So context is everything. And um, um, the bear is getting extremely wonderfully colored. Love you guys. Thank you so much. <laughs> so that sort of sets the context for what I'm going to just move into. And then we're going to ask the expert. Um, so I'm just going to move on here. We are excessively good at finding solutions for things. And I mean that in the sense that when we're doing our improvement work, um, we're good at finding a solution ourselves as the champions or, um, you know, physicians or nurses or whatever, and then we're due to the system. So we as the experts come away, we go to our, to our meetings, we 